Hi everyone, welcome back or welcome to my channel What This Love. My name is Corey. I hope all of you are having an amazing day, evening, or night when you're watching this video. For today's video, I'm going to be hauling all the candles that I purchased this past weekend for the buy one, get one free candle sale at Bath & Body Works. I have, let's say, 18 candles here and I did purchase more online within, of course, my obsession with candles and anything from Bath & Body Works. So we're just going to get right into it. As for this candle drop, they did drop the last two as from the Ice Cream Shop collection. So the Rose Body or Ivy Vanilla Bean and the Mint Chocolate Chip Milkshake, which that one is my favorite. Out of those two, I am burning the Limoncello Unicorn Sprinkles over there. And then the PB&J ice cream candle right there. So both of the first two that were released, I am burning right behind me. If you want to check out that review on my channel, I've been enjoying those two candles. So we have three crates, 18 candles. So we're just going to hop right into it. My store has these bags here and... Yeah, they don't really um, suit the well suit the best for um, candle crates since they did get rid of paper bags for some reason at our store. However, for this crate here of the six candles, um, total was fifty three dollars and sixty eight cents, and saved a total discount of one hundred nine dollars and six cents. So, yes, that is a great seal just for, what, $53.68 for six candles? Like, right off the bat, that's less than, um, what, two candles combined? And the lowest within that, because I used the 10 off 40 and 25% off, so the lowest the candles came out to was $8.12, so less than candle day. First candle we have is Gingham. Love this new repackage of Gingham. Notes of blue freesia, white peach, and fresh clementine. Yeah, it just smells like a summery, sort of like citrus floral. Also with that cozy like undertone on top of all the notes. I've never like cared that much for the original gingham and like the body care in that however i do enjoy this candle so i can't wait to burn this one <laughs> my favorite which you'll see i think two more in the next crates but this is my favorite candle so far that has been released this year at bath the body works ice lemon pound cake can't get enough of this our store was dwindling down within these two candles here, I was able to sell two of them for, I think, yeah, two out of the three, like that one night that I was working my shifts, so, yeah, I did see this one and previously the two that I have upcoming, but I do love ice lemon pound cake, sugarly glaze icing, pure lemon zest, and fluffy pound cake with, with whipped cream, excuse me. Yeah. But I'm telling you, I just love this candle. It brings me so much happiness with all the notes while it's burning. And still need to get my hands on the body care. Been holding, been like not purchasing that within, I believe, over a month now. So I definitely have to get a move on that. Here we have the rose water, ivy, and vanilla bean. Love the packaging with the whole wrap with the sprinkles and yes this is definitely what it says vanilla marshmallow soft rose petals rain kiss english ivy however i don't know the last two notes like rose and english ivy i don't know what ivy is supposed to like smell like because i forget how the original rose water ivy smells 
but it's sort of in the ice cream family with the other three of these ice cream shop candles. Definitely get the marshmallow and, I don't know, it's like a hint of strawberry to it, like a strawberry candy or something. I've been hearing some people compare this to the positively sweet chocolate covered cherry candle. And I do see that in the same family with this one, but I'll probably try to burn those two together. However, I only have one of the positively sweet candles left in my collection. Did purchase a, another of the rose water ivy vanilla bean. And this one right here, which I did start burning. I will have to do a review on it. It's definitely a medium throw so far that I burned it in my small bedroom here. However, I'll be taking these over to my college dorm room to burn these to see if it makes a difference or within the throw of fragrance. But yeah, do enjoy rose water and ivy. Get that crate out of the way. Uh, next we have my favorite out of the two. This is mint chocolate chip milkshake. I absolutely love this. Again, with the candle wrap and all the sprinkles. Yeah, it's just... I am a huge fan of peppermint candles from Bath & Body Works. You have the peppermint hot chocolate, peppermint sugar cookie, and peppermint marshmallow. And this just fits right into the same scent family with mint chocolate chip milkshake, notes of mint ice cream, chunky chocolate chips. Those three words together, definitely try to say that how many times. Chunky chocolate chips and whipped cream. So I did burn this one. As you can see, I have to pick up a few of the little um, flakes of soot, if that's what you call it, that are just sitting there. However, same medium throw, which I'll be doing a like depth and review of this candle with the rose water and ivy, vanilla bean. So for this bag right here, it has two crates of candles. So the first six that I just showed you are the last six that I purchased for the buy one, get one free. But these 12 right here are what I purchased beforehand when that 10 off 40 was not available. So these candles were down to lowest being $9.35 with my 25% off. Spent a total of $146.80 and saved a discount of $176.91. So either way, within like the first six I showed you and what I'm going to show you now, I still saved like a lot of money within the discounts of all the sales on top of it with the coupons. So we're just gonna get these crates out real quick. Don't mind me, I am struggling to get this bag out of the way. <laughs> so we're just going to hop right into it. Have a, another ice lemon bow cake. Another ice lemon pound cake. As you can see, I am obsessed with ice lemon pound cake. Here, this is a totally different vibe. This is turquoise waters. And I recall having the wallflower this probably over a year ago in our kitchen downstairs. And yeah, it's definitely a aquatic scent, cozy, relaxing, notes of coastal waves, sparkling bergamot and sun-drenched musk. Love bergamot and musk. So, I can definitely say, hopefully, that this is going to be a strong throw with also the blue colored wax. So, can't wait to burn this on a hot, summery day. Here we have Gingham Gorgeous. Love the wraparound. Notes of pink strawberries, peach nectar, peony bloom. Same as the body care. And yeah, it's just within the peach and strawberry that I love. Personally, Gingham Fresh is my favorite out of the whole Gingham line. 
but it's been going back and forth between Gangnam Fresh and Gangnam Gorgeous. However, Gorgeous and Vibrant, which don't get me wrong, I do love Vibrant. However, Gorgeous and Vibrant don't like stick on my skin for that long. I don't know if other people are able to smell it after I use that on myself, but Fresh is definitely one that stays on my skin. And yeah, I do love Gingham Gorgeous. I believe this will be strong within Burning in the Candle because of the light pink wax. I do wish Bath and Body Works would sort of color the wax just like within this specific candle and do that to all the candles related to their packaging. Because I don't know if that would make a difference for like fragrance throw or of course that would draw more people into purchasing them if the wax was like not white for most of the candles. <laughs> However, we did get a, another Gingham Gorgeous. Get this right out of the way. And here we have Blue Bungalow. I believe this came out last spring. I recall the name, but I never picked it up. But I do love all the tropics around it with the elephants. Yeah, to my nose, it's like a fresh linen. Excuse me. <laughs> you have notes of salted sea breeze, beach side, you beach side <laughs> eucalyptus, and floral shores. I don't get much of the floral. It's definitely the eucalyptus with that like saltiness of I don't know, sort of like that linen fragrance. But yeah, I can't wait to burn this and hopefully it is strong just like the rest of these candles. Did get another <laughs> mint chocolate chip milkshake. You'll be seeing in a future video that I got too many of these. So either way, that's my personal problem. But I knew that I was going to love this mint chocolate chip milkshake candle. Because I just love anything. Banana mint i have like some mint candles in my collection that's for the ones that i mentioned and will definitely be adding <laughs> too many of these to my candle collection so here we have a another rose water was watery rose water ivy and vanilla bee it's just so weird with them saying that because it it's like rose water plus ivy plus vanilla bean so it's definitely a well name however can't stop smelling this one along with the mint chocolate chip milkshake. Here we have another Day packaging. Thanks for everything. This is sugar and lemonade. I never had sugar and lemonade, but besides, I did have blueberry sugar plus sugar and lemonade. Don't know if that counts. To me personally, it doesn't since it was one of those. Um, Combination candles, blends candles, that's what I meant to say. But yes, definitely <laughs> provides me of drinking like lemonade on a sunny, summery day. And you have notes of fresh lemon juice, sugar crystals, and crushed ice. Yeah, I could definitely see myself purchasing more of these. Alongside the ice lemon pound cake. I don't need any more of those, but something about it I always just panic by when it comes to candles and possibly body care. Either way, I overbuy in anything that I have from Bath and Body Works, but that's just what I have passion for within working there and also my collections of body care and candles. So can't stop smelling this one and I do love the engraved lid just play some music but yeah I will definitely have to do like a video on lemon candles in my collection I don't care that much for sugared lemon zest on cold at Bath and Body Works so I don't see myself purchasing that one but next candle we have pineapple mango I always love pineapple and mango fragrances, so I decided to pick this one up. And it also has like an engraved lid. Yeah, definitely 
reminded me of a pineapple milkshake which you have notes of fresh pineapple juice, mango, vine ripened raspberry. I don't get much of the raspberry, just get more of that fresh pineapple juice with the hint of mango combined. So, can't wait to burn this one here. And don't mind me, but I have to readjust because my foot always falls asleep when I am recording. <laughs> Don't ask me why, it just always happens. Here we have Pink Peach Blossom. It's so funny with this candle because online I was looking at the reviews within purchasing it. Well, within before purchasing the candle in stores. And some people were saying this smells like butter. Other people have been saying it smells like odor on cold. Like B.O. Personally, I don't like saying that. But... I do get like the peach and what it says, peach nectar, magnolia, petals, sweet mandarin. I get that orange mixed with the peach nectar. And yeah, it doesn't smell to my nose like B.O. I do get like that buttery note. So hopefully when it burns, it's like a, oh, whatchamacallit, a peach cobbler possibly like with that butter undertone I don't know I'll have to do a review on this hopefully as well but if not it will be in my candle empty videos whenever I get around to burning this one but I just love the simplicity of this collection for Mother's Day and yeah can't wait to burn pink peach blossom so the last candle here get that great out of the way as well <laughs> the last candle that we have to haul is tea tree never mind fresh mint and tea tree i got that backwards sorry fresh mint and tea tree and yeah it definitely smells like extra experiment gum so i can definitely see this be a powerhouse no matter where i'm burning it have notes of bright spearmint, tea tree, and rosemary. You get all three of those, and <laughs> yeah, just I can't wait to burn this one as well. It definitely reminds me of using, of course, like the scent of tea tree oil on my skin for like my acne and that. Like, you do get that hint, that like throw and power of the tea tree and the undertone of the spearmint. So, I definitely see this being a powerhouse during a hot summery day within, of course, like the sun, relaxing, self-care, all that stuff during summer. So, love this one along with all the other 18 candles that I hauled. As I mentioned, you'll be seeing... <laughs> excessive amount of the mint chocolate chip milkshake more candles of that in a future video for whenever those arrive in the mail but thank you so much for watching make sure you hit that subscribe button down below along with the notification bell to be notified when i upload upcoming haul videos review videos shorts any of that revolving around Bath and Body Works. So thank you again. Have a nice day and a good night.